Do you want to see what's inside of the planner that I use every single day to plan my life? In this video, I'm going to walk you through all of the pages that I use inside of my A5 file facts. So if you want to see that, then keep watching. Hi, I'm Wenda from wonderful.com. I help creative planners like you find functional and productive ways to help you get more things done. Hey guys, so in this video that I'm sharing with you today, I'm gonna to be walking you through my A5 Austerly file facts in wine. Um, I actually replaced the rings, so these gold rings are from Amazon. They are from a brand called Stationary Life, and it they have this whole kit where you can easily change out the rings of your ring binder, and I just think it looks perfect with the wine um, planner. So I use my A5 planner because it really helps me um, to plan everything a lot better. I think better on paper, so this is why I need to still have a paper planner um, alongside my online management system. And then I just simply transfer over everything that I plan out on paper into my online management system, which is ClickUp. Um, I use ClickUp to organize everything and it syncs up to my Google Calendar, which makes it really useful for me to set up reminders and to just have everything organized um, on there. But when it comes to everyday planning and organizing, then this is the one I use. For goals and big picture planning, I use this planner to plan it all out. Even for day-to-day -day tasks, I use this planner to help me stay focused and not get distracted by you know, other browsers or apps on my phone. Um, this planner also helps me stay on top of my health and fitness, my finances, um, habits that I'm working on because of the day-to-day -day tracking that I can do um, with my habit trackers and financial trackers that are in this planner. All right, so let's just get started on the planner flip through. So this planner, um, is what I use to plan my days and to kind of look at my weekly and monthly and goals and keep track of everything. So in the beginning, I have these task cards with routines on them. Um, I got the idea for these task cards from Maddie Plans. You can check out her Instagram to see how she uses it. And then um, I have tabs for yearly, monthly, weekly, daily, habits, health, money, goals, notes, and lists. So in the yearly section, I have my word of the year, um, a yearly habit tracker. Um, I haven't filled anything out yet because I wanted to make this video first. And birthdays and anniversaries. And in the monthly section, I have a blank month on two pages. So we have a monthly overview on this side and then the important dates and weekly goals. And that repeats for the whole month, uh, for the whole monthly section. And then we have the weekly section. And in the beginning of the weekly section, we have an ideal weekly schedule and the weekly routine. And I included two copies in case, you know, your routines maybe change during the summertime or, you know, so like maybe one for summer, one for the rest of the school year. And then we just have a regular week on one page with the boxes up here and then a work tasks and personal tasks for the week. And then when we get to the daily section, I have just the uh, schedule. So we have 6 a.m. to 9 p.m. and we have your top three priorities for the day and just a random to-do list. And the way I like to use it is by kind of color coding on my tasks. So yellow for me is always home and meals. Purple is blog and then blue is the kids school. And then pink is uh, personal. So I kind of just time block my tasks into certain times throughout the day so that I can get them done. What I love about these daily pages is that um, 
I can work off of my tasks list without getting distracted. So most of my tasks are on ClickUp, uh, which is my digital project management tool, my online project management tool. And that has that houses like all of my ideas and tasks and everything. And it's like organized into lists, but I like putting all of my daily tasks for the day into here because when I'm working, I can just focus on that and not get distracted with every other idea that I have. So this is why I really, really need a paper planning system because it just helps me to stay focused and not worry about anything else. And the next section is habits. So we have a key habits for your goals. And, and then we have the habit tracker for each month. And then after that, we have a weekly habit tracker. And then you can review your habits to see what's working and what's not and how you can improve. And then I have a cleaning schedule for daily tasks, weekly tasks, and monthly tasks. And then we have health. So for health, um, just breakfast, lunch, dinner, exercise, vitamins, and water. So we have a bunch of those. And then we also have a gratitude, uh, one line a day tracker. Uh, you could just write something for the whole month on one page. Then we have the my wellness routine. And for this, um, this is just kind of like a way to help to make sure that you are taking care of your body and you know resting meditating eating your fruits and veggies drinking water and sleeping enough hours a day and then we have a before and after for your body measurements and go-to meals and then we have money in the money section i have a annual bills tracker for the entire year and then we have the income tracker for the entire year and then for each month, we have a monthly budget, a revenue tracker, expenses tracker, and online shopping. And then that just repeats. And then we have goals. And this is one of my favorite sections for planning out my goals. So I always kind of brainstorm and do my goals on here. And then I transfer them to ClickUp after. So for my goals, I have you know all these sections here. And then you pick your top three that you want to do for whichever time frame you want. So if you work with yearly goals, then you can do that. But for me, I always work in quarterly. So I kind of left that open so that you can choose your goals. And then this is how I break down my goals. So I have an annual plan, which has your quarterly goals for the entire year broken down into monthly uh, like big big monthly goals or projects and then you go even further each quarter by so you would just take your quarter one focus and then you would put your targets for that quarter here and then the monthly targets here and then i have a section for how to improve and your achievements at the bottom and then it kind of just continues into monthly. So, you know, you break down your quarterly goals into monthly targets and then into weekly targets. And then from weekly targets, you break it down into daily targets. And this, and this would be like your plan for what you need to be doing every single day in order to reach those big goals. And then I have a goal planner, um, a couple of goal planners here. So you can break down your big steps your you know your projects into little steps so that it makes it more doable and then I also have timelines so these are like Gantt charts to manage your projects so that you're not working on everything all at once it helps you to just break down your goals because you know you can't do everything right now but if you spread it out then you would be able to kind of plan for when to do those okay and then we have our notes section so in the notes section I just have a bunch of uh, blank notes that you can use any way you want and then I also have my planning routine so what I do to plan annually monthly weekly and daily so I just kind of refer to this every time I'm planning I also have a blank version if you have your own method that you 
want and then I have my GTD checklist by David Allen that's getting things done so you know it's capture clarify organize reflect and engage so that's the system I love to use then we have lists and this is just all the lists that you need to keep track of so we have a projects list a project tracker a to-do list a shopping list um, a brain dump grocery list don't forget to order online my wish list passwords and packing lists so yeah that is what I use to keep track of um, my plans on paper Thanks so much for watching. If you like this printable planner, I sell it in my wonderful plans bundle as well as by itself. It includes all the inserts you saw in this video.